Just getting the rods ready for the river and lakes. We've got a few videos planned. I won't say what. But I've just got a 9 foot 6 Shakespeare Omni X Ledger rod. It's a great little rod all rounder. You can screw a uh, swing tip in there or quiver tip. Or it's a nice little float rod with a nice little Shakespeare Mat 1 XT little 2000 reel. I've got a battle zone rod there, probably won't use, probably won't use that one. I've got 17 foot Zebco Trophy Bolognese rod with a Shakespeare 4000 Carbo reel. Got a little 11 foot Shakespeare Omni X uh, match rod again with 2000 Shakespeare Omni X reel. Two pound line on there. I've got a 12 foot Shakespeare Mac X2 barbell rod with a 4000 uh, reel. I've got a Shakespeare Mac 2 XT 14 foot. Waggler rod, it's actually a commercial waggler rod. It's actually 10% extra power with an old, very old. I've had this since I was 18, 17, 18. Was, I've, I've used it about six times in that time. Look at it, straight out of the box. It's pristine. It's like the day it was made. That's a Dio RG1 655 reel auto cast 2.5 float fish line on there. Absolutely mint condition. Bit of waggler work on that one. I've got a Zebco, Zebco Trophy 14 foot float rod with my trusty Abu 1044 close race reel. I've got a 13 foot Shimano Katana 390 FA fast action rod for light stick float work with my good old fashioned. Abu 506M reel there. Still going strong after all these years. Probably doing better than me. <laughs> and I've got the uh, Drennan 1517 foot rod with a dial 120M reel. And that should keep me going for the next few sessions. I've got a bit of uh, stick float bolo work and waggler work uh, ideas lined up. So stay tuned.